You can see from HD Chopper 8 how flames burned more than 200 acres. We were cutting some fences and wetting houses down. And Those same flames surrounded volunteer neighbor Brent Wilson on his compact track loader, which caught on fire, forcing him to run to safety. Well, it got a little smoky and got a little hot, so I decided to get out of it. And some guys showed up and we tried to put it out. Got it put out pretty good before it did too much damage. As emergency crews from multiple departments battled the blaze on the ground, aircraft repeatedly dropped liquid from the air. That helped contain the flames, which had already gotten the attention of Wise County resident Zach Vess. Like, man, there's something on fire around here. Zach shared this cell phone video he recorded while driving home and being concerned about wind direction. We'll make sure it don't come across the street for sure. I mean, everything's so dry right now, it's just everything will go up in flames. Wise County Chief Deputy Craig Johnson gathered volunteer information in case they're needed again, especially with what's in the forecast. Drives the fire quickly, and the higher the wind and the drier conditions, it's really it's really ideal for something like this to happen. By nightfall, firefighters conducted perimeter patrols. They found hot spots hours after containing the fire. Not only did emergency vehicles light up the horizon, but so did remaining stubborn flames. In Wise County, I'm Scoop Jefferson.